can I help him escape? I mean, yeah, what else? But first, we have to escape this place. I mean, the door is open right now, we can just escape. It's better at night time. Okay, fine. But first, we have to plan out how to stay. Tom, you're here? Yup, and I'm ready to take the kids. Yup, they're right here. Wait, what's going on? Uh, oh, my two new daughters. Huh? What? Are you already getting adopted? Oh, wow, Tom, your work is fabulous. I love how you put John Brick behind bars and you expose a multi-millionaire. You truly are a hero. Keep it up, Tom. Ah, that, thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. Well, Mr. Tom, I do have one question. Why are you adopting John Brick's daughters? But, like, it seems kind of strange, especially since you were the one that exposed their father. Wait. <laughs> This is the guy who put our father in jail? Oh, well, it's because John Brick's a bad man indeed. But his daughters are just innocent girls who were unfortunate enough that their father is John Brick. They just want to live in a normal society and unfortunately they were raised by John Brick. So I want to be nice and give them the life that they deserve. I don't want them to be or orphans and I don't want them to be separated. Which is why I decided to adopt them and give them my love, which I bet John Brick had never given them. He gave me an iPad. And he gave me an iPhone. What are you going to give us? I'm going to give you a real father. A father that cares about you. A father that doesn't just give them an iPad or a phone. Has your father even given you a hug ever once? Of course he gave us a hug. He gave us a hug in... Um, when? Uh, 1974? Oh wow, that's great. You guys should appreciate your new dad. Because he's actually a pretty cool guy, you know? He's gonna give you guys food, water, random stuff. But yeah. How do you feel? Drummick's gonna be that killed. So, ha <laughs> ha. No one asked for your opinion. <laughs> Yo, weirdo. Is would you like if your dad was about to be put in jail and about to be dead? to be adopted by the guy who put him in jail? I was an orphan. <laughs> oh, wait, until, yeah, I had no parents, so yeah, I would gladly. Well, that's a you problem. All right, come with me now, kids. We have to go. Hey, you have to leave now. Go, go, quick. He's going in the car. Oh, what about our plan? What do we do now? Let's go with the flow right now. Hey kids, get in the car. Don't worry guys, I'll be the best parent you guys will have. This guy is ugly and this car is ugly. Okay, and then in 2003, my grandma had cancer and then we were deciding what we can do about it. And so, we thought of different ideas. And so, we decided that we can come out with chemotherapy. <coughs> and so we decided that we can maybe do that or this. Alexa. How are you listening to this? Can't bear my ears. Oh, I'm using AirPods. Here is my house, guys. My new house. I actually bought it last week. What type of ugly house is this? It's, this house is crooked than his teeth. Even my camper um, across the street is better than this. Where is he? Hey kids, I'm on the top floor, just come up. This house is so big. Yeah, it's like we're running a marathon. Okay guys, this is your guys' bedroom. Look at the view, isn't it beautiful, eh? And you guys' washroom is just right there. 
This house feels really unstable. Yeah, and I don't like these windows. It seems like someone's gonna stalk us at 3 a.m. We should think about escaping tonight. But how? All the hallways lead to his room. But we should get revenge on this guy. He literally put our dad to jail, and our dad's about to die. How? Hey, kids! Dinner's ready! Dinner, huh? I have an idea, Alexis. Dinner? Inspire. Inspire means revenge. That was the worst dinner I've ever had. Alright, uh, kids, I kinda have to use the washroom. So if you guys want, you guys can watch your, um, you guys can use your iPads or you guys can go watch the television for a little. Fire equals revenge. On fire. Wait a second. Run. Before we leave, there's just something I didn't tell you, Alexis. There's a gun in here. Really? Is there two? Oh. What, why is there fire? Oh my! Uh, what, what's going on? Uh, oh, uh, uh, oh, my, oh my god! What's going on? Oh my! Ah! Guess we're runaways now. Bro, that was pretty fire though. Get it? <laughs> it's our plan to save dad. Don't forget, I have all these plans and ideas on our clipboard. I realized that the daycare is right next to the police station. I just realized the playing tubes are right next to the prison yard. Maybe we can enter the playing tube, and I think it will lead to the prison yard. Let's go in then. Maybe we could jump across? No, bro. The, the fence is electric. Is that yellow block? Maybe we can jump to that and get inside the yard without touching the wires. Well, that seems like a pretty big jump, but let's try it. Um, wait a sec. Is that? Alexa and Alexis? What are you doing? What in the- Dad, you're actually here? How do we save you? Kids, there's no point. Tonight, they're gonna take me to the the, the gallows. Because tomorrow's my execution. What is gallows? The gallows is a, it's a place where they execute people. And I don't know why you're even back here. Because there's no point. Wait, you're so- wait, so you're telling me that me and Alexis are trapped in this prison yard? Well, you guys are not technically trapped. You know those fences right there, right? They're not actually electric as they seem. They're just fake fences. Wait, what? If those are not even electric fences, then why don't prisoners escape? Well, kids, it's because literally in each fence there's a camera pointing right towards it. And so, many people try to escape, but they just easily get caught, especially since the fences lead right up to the road. Why is that door open? Uh, kids, uh, that door, usually people, the police guards just come out here to take a smoke break. I would advise you not to run through there. Okay, Dad. Pick 
up right now. But what are we gonna do after that? Oh, I see. Ah, they're here to take John Brick. Time to get John Brick. Um, hey, officer. Uh, wh why are you here? You know, Mr. John Brick, why you are going. Tomorrow is your execution. Because you are a bad man. If I am bad, are you with my dad? Uh, okay, okay, just stop. Just, just, no, you come with us. Uh, Mr. Brick, I'm the driver and I'll be taking you to the gallows. Please enter the back. I can't believe John Brick in the back. Oh, he's here. Oh my god! Help! Wow, I can't believe you killed that man. Let's go save her father. <laughs> Dad! Hey kids, what are those gunshot sounds? Why are you guys here? Oh, uh, we just killed the driver. This is nothing much. Ah, that's my daughter's. You guys sit in the back. Quick, quick. I know a place where we can hide. But Dad, where are we gonna go? We're basically wanted here. There's a place that only I know, which I built and hidden somewhere in Brookhaven. We will stay there for a few days, then we'll plan out how to escape Brookhaven. <laughs> Dad, where are we? Guys, quickly, follow me! Are we hiding in the hills? Whoa! What in the world? Where are we, Dad? Welcome to my secret base, daughters. This is where we're gonna be hiding for a few days. We're gonna be escaping Brookhaven. Kind of stinks. Wait, Dad, why did he go to jail in the first place? Um, because uh, um, uh, it's because they thought I was doing something. But it wasn't, and they were trying to, like, since I'm very popular, the mayor was mad at me, so they were trying to like, kill me. And, um, no, and then your grandma, she came and she put a curse up. Um, no, okay. your grandpa came. Uh, uh, yeah, something like that happened. You guys, you guys are young, you don't even know about it. Okay, I gotta do my work, so get lost! Isn't that the best? Yeah, it's still kind of the impasta. I'm gonna do some research. Why are you on Google? Huh? J O H N G R I C K. Enter. This cannot be real. Our, our dad is evil? This can't be. Let's show him. Yeah. Dad? Dad? What is it now? 
is this? Explain. It's nothing and uh, oh oh. Uh, oh. I'd rather be Thomas' daughter. Yeah, he was a much better father. Like, why why would we burn his house down? You are evil. What a liar you are. We should have saved you. You should have died. We're telling on you. I can be bad indeed. But I can be much worse. <laughs>